This morning on Today in Depth, home sweet home reimagined. Since the <laughs> pandemic began, as we've witnessed, home prices have risen at the highest rate in 15 years, with so many people reconsidering where they want to live. That's right. But this morning, there may be a cost-effective solution, and the answer could be a 3D printer. No joke. NBC's Kathy Park shows us how it works. For decades, home builders have used hammers, nails, and concrete to put houses together. Printers were used for, well, printing. But now those two worlds are colliding. Home building has a whole new look thanks to a 3D printer unlike anything you've seen before. In Long Island, SQ4D constructed the first 3D printed home for sale to the public. We're trying to build houses uh, in half the time for half the price. Our profits will be higher and we will be able to show that with more projects that we do. A 1,400 square foot, three bedroom, two bath home built in two days using 3D printing technology. Listed for just under $300,000, it's approximately half the cost of a comparable home in the same area. And offers came in by the thousands. We've been looking since September of last year. It's just impossible to find anything at this price. And this quality. How are 3D homes shaking up the housing market right now? 3D printed homes couldn't have come at a better time. We have a housing shortage and a labor shortage, and 3D printed homes really solve both those problems. Homes of the future, now a reality, as companies look to scale up with 3D. For today, Kathy Park, NBC News. Wow, that just completely blew my mind. And to think also it's helping people who've been displaced. Yeah, no doubt. I was going to say there's going to be a lot of conversations you can imagine right now. We'd like a third bedroom. Print. Print, right? please. If only it were that easy. Make yeah. life pretty good these days.